Buenos dias! We're here on the very southwest tip of Puerto Rico today, hiking um, around Cabo Rojo and the Cabo Rojo Lighthouse, also known as El Faro. It seems to be mostly volcanic rock under our feet and all around us some really spectacular views of not only the lighthouse but cliffs and sparkling turquoise water and salt flats and I think I'll have to give you a little taste of what we're seeing. This is, this is where we're standing, right on the edge of a cliff here. This is Cabo Rojo, the point, the red point. And we go just across the ocean. This is actually the Caribbean here. It's the southern part of Puerto Rico. And here's another cliff-like structure. There's actually a natural bridge over there we're going to hike to later on today. Some more trails over there. And here is this sort of bay. Um, what's this called? The Playa Huela? Yeah, La Playa Huela or uh, Playa Sucia. Okay. It is means... uh, Playa Sucia, which means dirty, but it's actually quite clean. And then uh, we see the uh, salt flats here in the distance. Up here is the lighthouse, which is the destination of our hike today. And uh, supposedly it's a mile and a half round trip from the parking lot to the parking lot. And someone's out here sailing today. And a uh, towing a barge way out there in the distance but I can't see with this camera but this is just this is just spectacular here <laughs> the cliff well, let's continue on our hike wow this is just stupendous look at this a little breezy today Just look at this. Whoa. Wow. Wow. Uh, just look at that man all day. Just more of the stunning scenery here. Lisa? Hiking up the trail. Oh, look at first full view. Oh yeah, here it is. First full view of the lighthouse. Oh. No, not sure we can get in there, but then we can get at least maybe inside the, the gates there. See other, a few other people in there. Wow. You don't want to stand over here. There's, you don't want to stand over there anymore. You don't want to stand where you were standing. Uh, here's some crystal clear water down here. We haven't seen much of that. Interesting, the lighthouse is the least interesting thing here. Yeah, exactly. I mean, where you were standing? Wow, yeah. I didn't see that. There it is. El Faro. No, El Faro. This is complaining here that it needs a paint job, but it doesn't look bad. It looks somewhat maintained. 
Yeah, it's not bad. No, it looks like they tried to paint it, but the, it was just uh, in some places the the paint was light, well, watered they, down. It needed one more coat. Yeah. It's a lot clearer here. Ooh, Lisa's getting brave, getting to the edge there. There's this uh, interesting cactus here, top of the plateau with the lighthouse. Just pretty much just one. I mean, there's one over there, but uh, it's uh, pretty intriguing. Yeah, he's just growing beside it. Just really interesting rock formations here. Just, uh, I'm just again, you know, like, uh, like sort of stunned at the clarity of the water here. Yeah. Because nothing's been this clear, you know, Calabria or any any place. Most of you guys have been here during the winter, but. What can you say about this? You always think about Puerto Rico and their beaches. You don't think about the, that they have the cliffs and terrain like this, but it makes sense. Ooh, look at this. Wow. Well, oh, Ripley. Oh, natural so arch. That's why you can't walk down over there. People do. So he said, danger, at Egro. Now here's a little sinkhole. Goes right down through here. Got some wave action down there. I think this is one of the most interesting trails we've ever been on. Yep. And you go through here and it looks like you know, the rocks under our feet used to be ancient coral. And uh, maybe I'll see some, some kind of signs of that, but you see all these holes in it and it's, uh, it's definitely coral-y, coral ish You can see some of it there. Wow, this is cool. <laughs> Big holes. <laughs> Big hole right into. Wow. Cool. 
You know, if you can see this, this is a piece of coral. This is the kind of stuff you see just embedded into the trail. So you know that at some point in time, this whole area here was underwater. And then the water levels uh, sunk. Speaking, or, yeah, speaking of water, we're closer to the water now, not up yeah. on, on cliffs anymore. Water level, water level sunk, or the stuff rose. That's cool. Cabo Rojo comes from Yeah. Here's a picture from the other side of the point. Big Bay. Don't know what that town is over there. And another cactus right here. Here's the entrance to the trail we took, actually the exit for us. We can start this way. And here is the shortcut up to the uh, up here up to the lighthouse. And there's a parking lot here. So it's a Saturday, so there's a lot of cars here. Uh, we came early, well, fairly early. And we got a, a good park, decent parking spot closer to the beach. Thank you for joining us on this glorious hike around the lighthouse at Cabo Rojo. It is one of the most amazing hikes we've ever taken. I've never had to stop so many times to take pictures. Of course, the lighthouse is iconic, but it was the cliffs and the water and the rocks and everything else that, that really gave us pause and made us pause many, many times to take pictures and video. It's definitely worth coming. It's only about a mile and a half. It should take an hour and a half, but it's gonna take us several hours because we keep stopping. It's definitely worth risking your car to come out on the road to get here, which is very difficult. But uh, once you get here, if you're in any kind of shape, you can easily do it. Make sure you bring water, come on out, do the hike around the lighthouse at Cabo Rojo. Until next time, May your suitcase always be messy. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and ring that bell to be notified when we put our next video out. Hasta luego!